Robert Leslie Conley, better known by his pen name Robert C. O'Brien, was born in New York City January 11, 1918. Conley was the third of five children from a well-known educated Irish Catholic family. With interest in music and literature, Conley entered Williams College in 1935, but left in his second year. He later studied for a time at Juilliard because he wanted to become a pianist. He went on to receive his Bachelor of Arts in English at the University of Rochester in 1940. After graduation, he worked first for Newsweek magazine. O'Brien then married Sarah McClaston in 1943. The marriage lasted until his death 30 years later, March 5th, 1973. Together the couple had four children. He also had a dog named Nathan Lane and a cat named Joshua Robertson. He liked to name animals like he would name his children to make them feel like family. O'Brien worked as a reporter and editor for the Washington Times Herald. In 1951, having covered both national and city news, Conley began working as an editor and writer for National Geographic, a job which was to take him around the world. In 1953, he bought a small farm near Washington, D.C., and lived with his wife and four children as a farmer. In his books, he recreated these experiences with the most accurate detail. In 1963, Conley developed glaucoma. Because he could no longer drive to work, he and his family moved close to his office. In the time he saved from not having to commute, he began to write children's stories. Conley is best known for writing children's books under the O'Brien pen name. The first book Conley wrote was The Silver Crown, which was published in 1968 about a girl named Ellen who on her 10th birthday wakes up to find a silver crown on her pillow. A few minutes later, her house burns up and her parents disappear, and she is launched on an adventure involving a trek through the woods, a castle full of brainwashed captives, and the powerful Hieronymus machine which wants her crown. It was followed by the Mrs. Frisbee and the Rats of Nim in 1971 which received the 1972 Newbery Medal. This book was about a widowed field mouse, Mrs. Frisbee, who seeks the aid of a group of former laboratory rats in rescuing her home from destruction by a farmer's plow. His adult novel, A Report from Group 17, which was published in 1972, was chosen by the Book of the Month Club. This book is a science fiction thriller that looks into the intricacies of the world of DNA manipulation, gene mechanics, biological war warfare, espionage, and more. Robert C. O'Brien died in 1973 his last novel, Z for Zachariah, appeared posthumously in 1974, which received a 1976 Edgar Award for Best Juvenile Mystery from the, writer, the Mystery Writers of America. It is written from a first-person perspective of a 16-year-old girl named Anne Burden who survives a nuclear war in a small American town. The book takes the form of a diary kept by Anne 
as she recounts the events that followed the war. Here, as in his other books, two aspects of his personal life become clearly recognizable. His love for nature and his sympathy for an understanding of the young and vulnerable in their struggle to grow up. He only started writing fiction in the last 10 years of his life. In 1982, Mrs. Frisbee and the Rats of Nim was made into a significantly altered animated film, The Secret of Nim. Conley's daughter Jane, Leslie Conley, later published two sequels to Mrs. Frisbee and the Rats of Nim which were called Rasco and the Rats of Nim, which was published in 1986, and R.T. Margaret and the Rats of Nim, which was published in 1990.